In July, the world's attention turned toward a seismic discovery deep in the heart of Hunan Province, China. A lithium gold mine, one so vast in scale that it almost defies comprehension, had been uncovered, containing 540 million tons of ore, with a staggering 1.31 million tons of lithium oxide locked within its rocky veins. At first glance, headlines around the globe painted this as a remarkable breakthrough for the electric vehicle industry. For Tesla, on paper, it seemed like an unlimited ticket to battery security and lower costs. But the reality behind this glittering mountain of metal is far darker, and far more dangerous than most realize. This find is not a gift, it is a potential noose. Amid rising tensions between the United States and China, coupled with the aggressive tariffs introduced under Trump's policies that are now suffocating the flow of lithium imports, Elon Musk finds himself staring directly at what could become a $1.3 trillion ticking time bomb. It is a bomb that, if detonated by geopolitical friction, could cut Tesla's legs out from under it and hand the keys to the EV kingdom to its fiercest competitors. The question hangs in the air like static before a lightning strike. If Tesla depends on China for the lifeblood of its batteries, could that dependency one day cost them everything? For Musk, the answer is not a mystery. He saw this storm forming years ago. And while others were content to simply hope that politics wouldn't spill over into industry, Musk began quietly preparing something bold, something audacious. A contingency so extreme and transformative that it wouldn't just protect Tesla from a lithium chokehold, but would destroy the chokehold entirely. Today for the first time, Torque Element will reveal the shocking master plan for the 2026 Tesla aluminum ion battery, a technological strike designed to obliterate China's $1.3 trillion lithium stranglehold in one decisive move. If you care about the future of America's dominance in energy, innovation, and the automotive world, this is not just a story you watch passively. This is the blueprint for the next global industrial revolution. So hit that subscribe button because Torque Element is closing in on 2,000-1,000 subscriber, and the deeper we dig, the more earth-shattering these revelations become. The first question is obvious. Why exactly is China's lithium discovery such a massive threat to Tesla? The answer begins with the sheer magnitude of what was uncovered. This isn't just another mining story buried in the back of a trade journal. It is, by every measurable standard, a geopolitical earthquake. The Jiji deposit in Hunan province is so large it dwarfs the lithium reserves of entire nations. 540 million tons of ore, containing 1.31 million tons of lithium oxide, represents enough refined lithium to power somewhere between 26 and 30 million electric vehicles. Think about that. One mine has the potential to fuel more electric cars than Tesla's entire global production output for the next decade combined. At today's market price, hovering near US$1,000 per kilogram, the mine is valued at roughly $1.3 trillion. That's more than the entire gross domestic product of countries like Spain or Australia. Now here is where things get terrifying. This massive injection of supply could flood the market with Chinese lithium, driving prices down by as much as 50% by 2027. That might sound like great news for consumers, but it's a nightmare for Tesla. Why? Because Chinese EV giants like BYD would suddenly have access to an ocean of dirt-cheap battery materials allowing them to slash prices to levels Tesla would struggle to match, all while maintaining healthy profit margins. Tesla, by contrast, would face a brutal squeeze. Price wars in the EV market are not friendly competitions. They are survival contests where margins are weaponized, and even the smallest cost advantage can determine who lives and who dies. And that is before we factor in the most dangerous element of all. Dependency. Tesla's Shanghai Gigafactory is not just another facility in their portfolio. It is one of the largest EV production hubs in the world, pumping out 1.5 million vehicles every single year. It is central to Tesla's global strategy, and it sits right in the heart of China, fully exposed to the country's industrial policies and resource control. Now layer on another fact. China controls 70% of the world's lithium refining capacity. That means that even if Tesla sources raw lithium from Australia, Chile, Argentina or the United States, all of which have substantial lithium resources, the refining bottleneck still leads back to China. In essence, Tesla is not just purchasing batteries from China. They are, in a very real way, renting their future from their single greatest geopolitical rival. And that rent could be raised, withheld, or outright weaponized at any time. Even Tesla's massive Nevada Gigafactory, which produces 35 gigawatt hours of batteries annually, still depends heavily on Chinese refined lithium components. Building a fully independent lithium supply chain from scratch, one that includes extraction, refining, and manufacturing, 
would cost tens of billions of dollars and take years to complete. That's time Tesla may not have. So the question keeping Elon Musk awake at night is simple. Can Tesla break free from China's lithium grip before it's too late? Or will they be forced to play China's game with China's rules for the foreseeable future? In the EV industry, second place isn't just losing. It's irrelevance. But here's where the story takes a turn, and where Musk's genius begins to show. What if, instead of trying to outcompete China in the lithium game, Tesla simply walks away from the game entirely? What if Musk has developed a battery technology so revolutionary that it renders lithium, all of it, obsolete overnight? This is where we enter the realm of Tesla's most secretive, most ambitious, and most potentially disruptive innovation to date the plasma ion fusion battery. This isn't a minor evolution of lithium ion cells. This is a complete reimagining of how we store and deliver energy. And the implications are staggering. Imagine a Tesla capable of towing a 20,000 pound trailer without losing significant range. A vehicle that could operate for over 20 years without a single percentage point of battery degradation. A battery so cool running it requires no bulky thermal management systems at all. No pumps, no radiators, no fans, reducing complexity, weight, and cost. And here's the kicker. A production cost per pack of just $1,200, compared to the five to $10,000 competitors spend for lithium-ion equivalents. At the heart of this breakthrough is a hybrid aluminum-ion architecture, infused with a plasma-activated microcluster system. The energy transfer is handled not by conventional ion shuttling through liquid electrolytes, but by a stabilized quantum plasma lattice. This lattice allows aluminum microclusters to move and discharge energy at up to 10 times the density of current lithium-ion cells, without the thermal runaway risks that plague conventional designs. It doesn't just last longer, it heals itself. Micro damage that would slowly kill a lithium-ion cell over years is actively repaired within the plasma lattice in real time, extending the battery's functional life to potentially several decades. Combine that with aluminum's abundance, mined in over 150 countries, and suddenly Tesla's reliance on China's 70% lithium refining choke point evaporates overnight. And that is just the opening salvo. If scaled successfully, this technology could drop the price of the next generation Tesla Model 2 to under US$17,000. Analysts believe this would trigger a seismic shift in global EV adoption potentially handing Tesla 30% of the global market, over 7 million vehicles annually, by as early as 2028. Meanwhile, China's $1.3 trillion lithium deposit would see its value crater by as much as 75%. And Musk is not relying on hope to make this happen. Behind closed doors, in a project codenamed Operation Star Forge, Tesla is building the industrial backbone of this aluminum-ion revolution. A new $4 billion gigafactory is rising in Iceland, chosen for its near-limitless geothermal energy supply, which will power Tesla's custom-built, three-dimensional printed plasma reactors. These reactors cut production time by 60% compared to traditional assembly lines, and when fully operational in 2026, the plant is expected to churn out 200 gigawatt-hours of aluminum-ion cells annually, enough for over 3 million Model 2s per year with zero lithium involved. Musk is also building resilience into the supply chain from day one. Tesla has quietly secured long-term contracts with aluminum miners in Australia, Guinea, and India, locking in up to 15 million metric tons of battery-grade aluminum annually by 2026. In the first quarter of 2025, a $1.5 billion aluminum refinery in India, optimized specifically for plasma ion microclusters, will quietly go online with no flashy press conference, no investor day showcase, just results. And while the world's media obsesses over Hunan's lithium mountain, Musk is positioning Tesla to make that mountain as valuable as gravel. Analysts predict that once aluminum ion and plasma ion fusion hit scale, the lithium market could implode almost overnight, collapsing not just prices but the strategic leverage China has built over the last two decades. Tesla's Model 2, priced at $17,000 with a battery that lasts decades, charges in under 5 minutes, and tows like a diesel truck, would not just dominate the EV market, it would rewrite it entirely. Competitors like BYD, Toyota, and Volkswagen would find themselves fighting a battle they didn't even see coming. 
and Musk's ambitions don't stop with cars. Plasma ion fusion's cool running, long life cells could power Neuralink brain implants, Starlink satellites, even Tesla's Dojo AI supercomputers, all without rare earth dependencies or thermal limitations. This is not just about defeating lithium. This is about laying the foundation for a future where energy is abundant, affordable, and entirely free from geopolitical choke points. And that future is not decades away. It is being built right now. While the world panics over China's lithium treasure, Elon Musk is already 10 steps ahead, quietly constructing an aluminum-powered empire that could change the course of history. The question is no longer whether Tesla can survive a lithium crisis. The question is whether anyone else can survive Tesla once this technology is unleashed. So I'll ask you, do you think aluminum ion batteries can truly crush the lithium crisis and rewrite the global energy map? Drop your thoughts below. Tesla isn't waiting. The future is already under construction. Are you ready to be part of it?